So we're about to plant our uh, urban garden. I've been talking about this and finally I made space. I actually pulled plants out. I had this space that was beautiful, but it wasn't really um, feeding anybody. It was just pretty and taking up water and, and uh, lovely to look at. And I planted stuff that, that would attract butterflies and birds and stuff like that. But it's good to be able to eat off of the land and then <clears throat> donate whatever we don't eat to, uh, to different organizations that we'll put on the website and let you know where you can donate food that you have that you're growing and, uh, and teach your kids how fun this is. How fun is this going to be? This is going to be great. It's going to be fun. And it's a really beautiful <clears throat> garden. Yeah. I'm excited. All right, so we have uh, I always... Tasha, of course, from the show, and Joyce and Joel. And uh, Joel works here all the time helping us here anyway, and Tasha and Joyce are helping us learn how to do this. By the way, my dog is going to love this to go to the bathroom. <laughs> it's organic, right? Yeah. And, of course, Roberto is here uh, helping because it's not ready to pick yet, Roberto. I'm sorry. I'll get the babies. We're not ready to cook. Yeah. And every three feet, we're going to plant an eggplant. Every this... three feet? Yep. So there's certain vegetables that plant further than others. There are, yeah. These are going to get larger. Because they really, really grow, and they need a big root system. Oh, and I think you should put the first plant in. Okay. So do do I need a, um, a anything to, to, or just use your hands? Okay. And now, how deep does it have to be? Just like that. Right here. That's perfect. So the, basically the top. Yep. Okay. Mm -hmm. And pack it in pretty tight? That's not too tight. No, not too tight. Yep. Just sort of make sure that it's all covered. I think I'm tucking it in it. to go to sleep. <laughs> Night night. <laughs> Give it love. Give it love. Okay, so that's just gently. It. That's it. It's that easy. It's that easy. And we'll see whose plant grows better because I tucked mine in a little tighter. <laughs> oh, okay. okay. Oh, that's <laughs> the and you want to make sure that they're well watered, which they are, before you um, transplant them. So you water them in, in when they're in their container before you plant it. Exactly. So that the roots are soaked already. Yeah. So now this is regular eggplant? Yeah, that one. Well, is that is one the, the, the um, Black Beauty? Black Beauty? Black Beauty. Okay, and these are the white. Of course, you love that movie. Yeah. So for like the average person who wants to just plant like some zucchini and stuff, should they run out and get a lot of the potting soil? Should they just try it with the soil they have in their backyard? They should get some potting soil, I would suggest. Okay. What do we think about this? Did we get ripped off at the nursery? <laughs> yeah. This is like the Charlie Brown of bell peppers. I think you should put it in and let them have a chance. All right, I, I'm it all for giving something a chance. Let's watch, let's follow this one and see what happens. Yeah, I'm gonna mark it with a big, big sign that says, um, you go plant. Look at this, look at that, look Look what you could do, come on. Oh, oh wait, we didn't talk about that. To keep the gophers away, you put yeah. mesh underneath this to get, because I don't, we don't kill our gophers here. Don't tell the gophers, they'll all come. <laughs> but so, uh, so the gophers will eat all, all the plants, so you put mesh under, so that then they yeah. just come around the mesh. <laughs> He's a celebrity. Oh, well, listen, if you guys are gonna be in that That's one. the only kind I grow. <laughs> I should put sunglasses on it or something. <laughs> and a hat, like try not to be recognized amongst the other tomatoes. We should get some publicist tomatoes to plant around the celebrity tomatoes. And you know what, where the celebrity tomatoes are, we do a red carpet instead of just an aisle. There should be a stylist. That's right. Yeah. And, a, and a wardrobe. Someone to come and spray. Yes. Yeah. So the celebrities, there's one celebrity there, there's one celebrity there, and then there's a girl and a boy here, which will make more baby tomatoes. That's where you wonder where the baby tomatoes come from. Oh, is that how it works? It's from the girl and the boy. It's when you do the girl and the girl or the boy and the boy, you have to seek adoption. <laughs> <laughs> so like onions, garlics, chives can all grow together. Beans and corn are really good together because they sort of... Do some vegetables not get along? Some of them are not as complementary, yeah. What happens? Does Well, some of them give out different things in the soil that, that are complementary to the other plant that's next to them, and, and, and in some cases it's the opposite. So, Like it's survival again, like I, I need this nutrient and I'm going to steal it right. from you to... Yeah. Plants yep. are vicious. <laughs> it's all... Down below here, you can pluck off these little leaves, like that, and it'll help put more growth toward the tomato rather than the leaves. And as they grow, you can continue to do that. And Just then, take the smaller leaves off? Yeah, the ones on the, on the bottom. You don't okay. want to do them all, but, but in the beginning, you certainly want to get some of them. 
see you're getting the old hat at this time. I like it. It comes <laughs> naturally to me. <laughs> I love stuff like this. I, I can't believe it's taken me this long to do this because I've been talking about it and finally I just had to take some space away from, from some other stuff. It well, just makes been, sense. You don't want to water your plants in the middle of the afternoon and get the leaves wet. That's one thing you don't want to do. Because you'll burn the leaves. It, the water acts like a reflector and it ends up burning the leaves. This looks great. It looks really good. I love it. It's really Ooh. good. I love seeing visions come to life. Yes. Beautiful. All right. Thank you all. Thank, Thank you, you, everybody. Good yeah. job.